It seems that the royal press is steaming ahead today with a lot of updates, and of course, we're going to stay on top of it and give you these nuggets in bite-sized videos to keep you informed. This news comes exclusively from People magazine. Meghan Markle and Prince Harry were not invited to join the royal family at Balmoral Castle this summer. For years, the Duke and Duchess of Sussex have not been included in the royal family's summer gatherings in the Scottish Highlands. Sources tell people that King Charles is continuing Queen Elizabeth's tradition of heading to the Balmoral estate during the late summer, but the monarch hasn't included Harry and his family this time. While Prince Harry grew up going to Balmoral, it's believed that Meghan has never visited the 50 acre estate where the Queen died in September 2022. It was a place for picnics and paddling for the royal family. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex have established a new life in Montecito, California. Despite a positive meeting between father and son in February, following Charles's diagnosis, their communication has since failed and deteriorated. A friend of Prince Harry says that Harry's calls go unanswered. He has tried to reach out about the king's health, but those calls have also gone unanswered. Clearly, Charles simply does not care. This is a People magazine exclusive. I wonder who is leaking these articles and narratives to People magazine. It seems that the royal family and the UK press are working against Harry and Meghan, especially Meghan. This is evident because of the exclusive coverage about the royal family snubbing Harry and Meghan, it seems they want this information to come out, and they've given it to People magazine to present it as an exclusive. The question is, who is providing this information as an exclusive? Is it a random courtier? Probably not. Where are these courtiers getting their orders from? It seems likely that they are receiving instructions from someone directly associated with William or Charles. My bet is on William. He might commission stories like this to be released to the press about Harry and Meghan. He has been doing this through Jason and his team. So we need to focus on who is greenlighting these exclusives and releasing information like this. It's definitely coming from William. Charles not answering phone calls is not surprising to me, but they want to be seen as generous by giving exclusives while not inviting Harry and Meghan. However, they are willing to invite someone controversial like Prince Andrew to Balmoral, despite his scandals and legal issues. The royal family is upset about Harry and Meghan going to Colombia, reacting to this situation, and the UK press is questioning why they are going to Colombia if the UK is dangerous. The UK is dangerous because of the way they've treated Meghan Markle, yet they refuse to acknowledge their own mistakes. The UK press gaslights and doubts people until they are weakened, then destroys them. It's absurd to claim that the UK is more dangerous than Colombia. This imperialistic perspective, where the UK considers itself superior, despite its history of stealing and corruption, is problematic. So, where is this exclusive coming from? 